I don't think it always needs to be. Yeah. Hey yeah. guys. I think by club can you Hey guys, you really just sprung that on me. Yeah, I think it I think it already sets the tone perfectly. <laughs> How's it going? We're a big chill day today. It just rained super hard here in New York, so we're just like big chill moment right now and it's like, yo, this is fine, this is cool. Yeah. So just do it. Yo! Nice counter though. Uh oh. Bad counter there. <laughs> yeah, for real. Right now, Sora is two for two for good counters. Got a bit of a repeat, but oh now he's out of here. God. You gotta tech those, my guy. You gotta tech those. Unfortunate. You guys see that 6 0 to death on the second stock, though? It's like, he had, <laughs> like, Sora had Stitch Face literally sitting on the ledge, and I was like, this is gonna probably be something huge. I hope I clipped and it. And then, uh, we'll see King Stitch. Oh, that's funny. Oh, I didn't clip no, shit. No, Devin. I didn't clip shit. What happened? <laughs> oh, it happens. Yeah. All right. No stitch clip, uh, sadly. Have you guys enjoy the sampling of uh, Fight Club? Get the, from first, from get the first kill from and Sunday? the last kill. That's all that matters. They just, one sets the tone and one sets the point. One sets the tone, Tragic. one sets the point. Apparently, King Stitch has never fought a Daisy before, so, you know, that's fair. But has he fought Peach before? That's a good question. It's just like DZ just went woo at me and I didn't know what to do about it. She, like, what do you do about someone wooing at you? So, uh, an important test, question for you. Yes. Wow. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Vivi versus Sketch? Um, sure. That sounds like it could be fun. Okay, cool. Sick. Then I'll, put, I'll cue them for stream. Alright, so that's on deck. They both got a, yeah, they both got a DQ. And now. Uh, they're both waiting to play their next set. All right. Yo, what up, Joseph? How you doing, homie? Someone moves at you, you expect a chest slap. That's damn facts right there. I don't... Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't get it. I'm too white. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I've been spending too much time indoors. I have not, like, caught up. Game dose. 
Yo, we got those uh, basic peach combos. Good, good air dodge. Rita. You know, Roy has like so little end lag on a lot of his aerials. It's kind of terrifying. <laughs> it's like, bro, where's the lag? Is he like one of those characters that you have to not try to punish them that he, that he whiffs, but you have to like try to punish his? Oh, do you mean is a I part guess. two coming? Yeah. Roy? It feels like there always is a part two with Roy. Uh, I think it just depends on what he's coming down with. Like, what, what, what was, what were you talking? What specific scenario were you talking about? Like fair, like fair specifically. I feel like has like no end lag. Nair's Maybe. another one. I don't know how minus it. I mean, I can look it up. How minus it is. Uh, I think it's just crazy. I minus. feel like it could probably Nair it as Squirtle, but that's not fair. I have a four friend there. <laughs> To try to land on my block and I just go, don't touch me. What are you doing? Don't touch, don't touch me. me. So get away from me. Bad touch, bad touch. You know. Ooh, all right, that's a good roll, Reed. Oh, he was so close. To actually, he that turn up. Like, what do you do against Daisy when she's coming in that low, with Roy? Like, you just have to like try to wait for the go for the, the edge guard. You have advantage. They're coming low. You don't have to edge guard them. Just go. Just make it that they. Uh, you don't have to go off stage. Just go for the regular edge guard. They're in a really yeah. bad position, so take advantage of it. When you say edge guard, but you mean like ledge trapping? Ledge trap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I was like, what? That is like one of the things that Roy is actually pretty good at. Is uh, he has a lot of. Uh, it's hard to predict like what his options are going to be on the ledge, so he's really powerful yeah, in the situation. I mean, like, also the fact that it's just like 99%. Like, your your punish doesn't need to result in a kill. It just needs to result in result putting them off stage, stage again. Like, yeah. you can play that game again, so then you just get inside their head, and then they're going to be like, okay, god damn it, every button feels like it's the wrong button. And that's exactly what you want, because that's when you get the kill. So it's just like, okay, oh, they, look, they did normal get up. Wild, I'm going to grab them. You know, or there's hell. definitely moments when, when I'm being like ledge trapped consistently. And I'm like, I don't want to go for roll because I feel like if I go for roll, they're going to murder me. But it's like, I'm, I'm just getting knocked off stage repeatedly, so what am I doing here? Yeah, Ooh. I mean, like, for something that, like, Dill tells me to do, like, more, all, he's just like, just jump. Just just jump. And don't try to attack on your way down. Just 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 make it back. And I'm like, shit, man, you right. So, yeah. pretty much that. So. No, that actually makes a lot of sense. Forward air is Only minus is, like, four on block. Yeah, no, dude, it's mad safe on block. That is Even why I whip, can... it's pretty fast. So, interesting. Well, minus four, but then, like, what can he do out of, like, after that? If he blocks, then he's fine. But, like, if he tries to do anything, then if you have, like, Nair. a fast. Well, Nair is frame six. So, yeah, my squirrel Nair is fine. Yeah, that's why I've never really thought about too, thought too much about it. I think you can also just jab. What frame is jab? Is frame, like five. frame five. Frame five. Ah! Yeah, so it's like yeah, whatever. If you both swing at the same time, he's gonna win. So. Minus minus four, four plus whatever your out of shield option is. It's definitely more than one. Yeah, there's also the travel time of it, but yeah. All right, well, Daisy taking that. Yeah, good job to Sora. Uh, yeah, guys, so we actually expanded the, uh, the scope of the legal state. And uh, those, those black gloves actually look really nice. Yes. <laughs> like, those are, that's a nice, like, mink black glove kind of thing. I don't know, I don't know what animal that's made out of. I can't imagine that she doesn't wear an animal skin on her gloves. But... Does she take a crown off to smack you with it like, uh, like Peach does? Yeah, I imagine she does. They're the same yeah, I can imagine her just waving really hard. She just gives you a knuckle sandwich. <laughs> Sounds about right, but probably not. <laughs> and you know, like how she just waves at you and says, like, Hi, I'm Daisy. She just does that really aggressively. Yeah. To kill you with four air. Because <laughs> I didn't actually know that um, that Peach took off her crown to four air you with it until, like, I think Smash 4. Like, I never noticed that. That Until is Until someone wild. pointed it out to me. She's definitely been doing that since 2001. I'm oh, fully aware now, yeah. yeah. I just never noticed it because the animation like happened so quickly that I just never like really took note of the fact that she took her crown off of her head and then slapped you with it and then put it... Yeah, she definitely takes her crown off too, yeah. 